Hi, Ben Bray, it's Jess Fan TV, back with another video. And Rangers were an SPL action on Wednesday night at home to Ross County, where it finished Rangers 2, Ross County 0. Goals from Jermaine Defoe and Scott Arfield. And the start 11 for Rangers was McGregor Nets back for Paul Star, Goldson, Kasich, Barisic, Arfield, Davis, and Kamara in midfield, Ojo, Defoe, and Kent in the strikers. And yeah, it was a very weird game. Rangers looked to be more dominant, looked to be attacking, and seemed to kind of struggle to get the ball in the net, whether it was from you know ball going maybe too high or too quick for some players like uh, Goldson, Katic, Defoe. But Rangers got their goal on the 41st minute. Jermaine Defoe got Arfield tracking the player, getting the ball, passing to Defoe to score to make it 1 0. Start the second half, all the way about, Defoe sets up Arfield in the 47th minute for his goal, and yeah, Rangers cruising. And obviously, the main talking point on the 62nd minute, Defoe is going on goal, and I think it's. Donaldson called Donaldson or twenty five for Ross County. It looked to either touch him or Defoe just whatever reason went down and had to get subbed. Which hope I think there was talk of four between four to six weeks out, so not good in a way, but Arebo came on for him. Sixty eight minute Kent went off for Morelos and Jordan Jones came on for Davis. In 74th minute, and Rangers comfortably won 2 0. Some, and yeah, I, like I say, it was an okay game. Rangers didn't really do much but got the goals anyway. Again, a clean sheet and three points. I know that there had, and with the full being out, and a lot of people had said that they wanted, or there's rumours saying Rangers would go in the transfer market, and it was confirmed today that. Rangers signed the Romanian uh, kid Hadji with option to buy. So it obviously looks like Rangers have got a striker. And yeah, like I say, it seemed to be going well for Rangers. And the ward reports that Canberra had, I think, there was talks that he might sign. According to like certain papers, uh, they're saying that Canberra will join Rangers on loan for six months with options to buy. Apparently, Greg Doherty will go the other way on loan. Enes Hadji has signed on loan with options to buy, which seems to be really. From what it sounds really good, or has been, sorry, confirmed that Canberra has signed for Rangers. So, yeah, like I say, it looks uh, like some good signing as Rangers have done, obviously. I think what's good for Rangers is that both are loan deals with option to buy. It helps the... I think it allows Rangers to kind of see, you know, can they or should they uh, buy them? I think it's, like I say, I think it's something that, you know, if Canberra or Paddy does, doesn't do too well, then, you know, they go back to the clubs. Doherty possibly could come back to Rangers. But it's two strikers, Canberra, Canberra. Obviously playing on the wing, so it gives Rangers more options. And I know there has been rumours that Jones was to go out. I think Sunderland or Middlesbrough were after him. But we'll see what happens there. But players kind of come in or staying was Borna Barisic who signed a new deal till 2024. So massive signing, I suppose you could say, for Rangers. I think to have Barisic tied down to a brilliant deal 
obviously helps Rangers to keep him for a lot longer. I know there was rumours that AS Roma from uh, Italy wanted him, but again, like say, you know, Rangers keeping you know their main big players to try and get rid of bigger teams trying to sell them or buy them sorry, for cheap which I'm glad Rangers have done so overall a very good January in a way we'll see what obviously happens tomorrow which is the Aberdeen game which I know is going to be very fiery to say I know I think it'll be a good game I'm not too sure if Hadji or Kimberi will play or be on the bench. Hopefully, men on the bench, if they start, even better. But hopefully the bench and, yeah, we'll see if any other uh, signings can happen. Oh, I'm just checking if there's anything <laughs> But, like I say, we, I think it's been a, yeah, that's so far the only chance for Rangers are done, so, interesting I don't know or it's not been said whether Connor Goldson will be missing tomorrow there was reports saying that apparently his booking on Wednesday made him suspended there's talks that Morelos if he gets booked might be suspended as well so we'll see what happens but big thanks everyone that's been watching if you're new or you haven't please support the channel hit the like button hit the subscribe button if you want the notification bell just let you know when new videos are uploaded and I'll hopefully see you tomorrow night after the Aberdeen game. Alright guys, I'm out.